Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving. We're always and forever evolving. Hello, Leos. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Leos. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy-ass temple of yours, Leos, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to see what messages, source, your guardian angels, and your ancestors have here for you today. Shout out to the Evolving Spirits. Shout out to the Soul Tribe members in the Patreon family gang gang. I appreciate you all so much for your love and your continuous support. I thank you and I appreciate you all. And welcome back to our ones that are new here, Lions. Welcome, welcome, welcome. It is an honor and a pleasure to have you here, Leos. Definitely if the readings here today resonate and fulfill your spirit, we would love to have you here part of family as well. Don't forget to subscribe, share the content for who you know the reading here today today resonates for and Duffy don't forget to like all right Duffy get this reading out so that way all the beautiful lions can be aware of their romantic life okay all right so let's dive into your reading here today lions this week we are focusing in on the color red yes we're focusing in on our root chakra this week all right grounding and centering ourselves all right definitely working with ourselves spiritually mentally and emotionally here if you're new here leos keep up with the community tab that is where i do post the new colors that we transition into each week we do understand here on this platform that colors bring in their own frequency and vibration as they guide us along our spiritual journey here mentally physically and emotionally all right so definitely keep up with the community board where i do inform you of the colors that we transition into on a weekly basis here all right so let's go ahead and dive into your reading here lions let's see what's coming towards you for romance all right oh we have the five of swords here well 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 let's talk about it all right this could be an air sign here that some of you all are engaging here with all right this could be aquarius here a libra here or a gemini all right but i do feel like either energies that are outside of you and your person here we know the five of swords energy represents the mental state of mind here and it also talks about conflicts arguments disagreements here with external energies that are outside of you and this person or this relationship here leos okay so someone is conflicted about this relationship that you have with this particular person here rather this is you that's conflicted about this person Person or this person is conflicted about you, Leos, or other energies could be exes here that are conflicted about you and this person being together. This could be family member here that are in disagreement here about this particular situation here, but there's definitely some conflicts that are going on in or around the relationship here, all right? Yeah, we have the Ten of Pentacles here. Yeah, because I feel like people see that you two are happy here, Leos, okay? Some of y'all, this person could be an earth sign here a Taurus a Capricorn or a Virgo here they see that you two are very happy you're being very appreciative of each other and you're definitely loving on each other here okay you're not able to keep your hands up above each other here Leo's okay and people don't like that unfortunately okay but however you do have people that of course are happy for you two showing the ten of pinnacles here all right but unfortunately there are outside influences here that are not too happy about this you can have a lot of jealous envy energy around you too so watch your surroundings here leos okay yeah we have the um chariot count searing energy here some of y'all this particular person here could be a counselor here but i do see someone realizing that you know this is not it for me all right so someone is not happy with their relationship or happy with where they're at all right so i do see leos either if this is you or your person here someone is not happy about this relationship so i do feel like some of y'all could be talking to this particular person here or you could be dating this particular person here or for some of y'all this could be a third party situation here where this person is not happy with where they're at or 
wherever they're laying their head down here, okay? All right, and you could see that he's wishing this feminine energy here goodbye, all right? This is, you know, the cherry card, because as you notice, there's the two horses here in the background, and he's about to get on the wagon here and leave. So as she's sleeping here, he doesn't, of course, want to wake her, but he know that this is not for him anymore. He's deciding to remove himself from this particular relationship or whatever this situation or circumstance here is. He's no longer happy here with this particular woman okay or whatever it is that he does here so he's deciding to move forward some of you all this could be you feeling this way about this person or your ex here feeling this way about a past person here or your person okay just take it where it resonates i'm getting a lot of downloads for you okay but this is why i see the five of swords energy here some of you all this person here could have recently broke up with someone in their past or an ex here that they went through this cycle with of nothing but constantly conflicts and agreements that are not can be on the same page here and trying to agree to the same or, you know, agree to something. But I feel like there was always conflicts, always this person being disrespectful to your person here or vice versa, Leo's. Your person may be being disrespectful to you. You're not agreeing with the choices that they have been making here. So you decided to leave this particular situation or circumstance here. Yeah, we have the Ace of Swords here. Some of you all, again, this could be an air sign here, Aquarius, a Gemini, or a Libra here. We know the Ace of Swords talks about bringing in clarity, information, news in regarding a situation here where there was continuously arguments, fights, okay, arguments and fights, okay, a lot of it I'm seeing here, and this is why this person is deciding to leave, okay, yeah, we got the hangman here, somebody has gotten an understanding here, someone has gotten a new perspective when it comes to their life and what type of relationship they want, because you can see and notice how the hangman card here, this is also Pisces energy here, all right, some of you are Leo, this person could be a Pisces here or a Cancer here with the Chariot card, or again, they could be an air sign here with the ace of swords and the five of swords here aquarius gemini or libra energy here or again this could be an earth sign here a taurus a capricorn or a virgo here but whoever this is right anyone can embody the energies of the cards here but this particular person is no longer happy with their life or even their love life here they're not happy they feel like they're not getting reciprocated energy here okay the roles can be flipped or this could be you feeling this way leos and you're just ready to be over with it when it comes to this particular person here you don't want anything to do with this particular person anymore others of you all this is the type of relationship that you want you want to be happy you want someone to appreciate you you want someone to love you for who you are authentically here and not having to look a certain way be a certain way act a certain way you just want someone that's going to be genuine to you and make you feel welcomed and make you feel appreciated here is why i feel like you or this person here has gotten a totally different perspective on what type of woman or man or relationship period that you want you recognize that or this person has is why they're getting on that chariot and they're hauling ass because they now know what type of relationship they want yeah we got the king of swords here and you're setting boundaries for that you no longer want to be involved in third party situations here you know how this is a particular energy here that of course as i mentioned with the five of swords energy there's definitely a lot of outside influences here that have been involved or trying to be involved in this relationship or trying to tell your person person or tell you who you should date or who you should be in a relationship with when last time we checked leo's your ass was grown this person is grown they can make their own decisions here okay and some of you all this is what you've been fed up with because this person may have chose others over you or chosen another situation or circumstance rather than listening or you know taking the time out to get to understand you get to know you they've always may put you back on the back burner here or put their person here on the back burner and this is like no more of this i have gotten an understanding i got a different perspective on how i want a relationship and this here is not it i feel like the more that this person argue with this other person or this ex here the more they realize that look this is not a healthy relationship for me this is not what i've always had compassion and dreamed of having and this is definitely not it is why this person is ready to move forward okay and say his goodbyes and wish well 
All right. So, wow. Very interesting here today, Leos, regarding your reading here. Definitely, again, if the reading here, loves, is resonating for you. Again, don't forget to like, subscribe. We would love, again, to have you here part of family. And definitely make sure to adjust your notification bells for when I go live here on the platform. I do go live throughout the week for all Zodiac sign readings. If you would love to stop by and get a check-in before you get your day there started, we would love to have you to join us for Waking Tarot. All right, so I'm now going to move forward and use my raw tarot deck to see what are the energies that are surrounding you at this time, see how they feel, and of course, see how your person feels at this time as well. And if you would love to book a personal reading, Leos, I am available for personal readings. All that information, loves, is down below in the description box, all right? So let's see here. Let's see how the energies that are surrounding you and this person feels at this time. What are the angels? What do we have for Leo? Wow, this card jumped off on the table. Excuse me one second, or on the floor, I should say. Wow, Leos, I want you so bad. Wow, this person wants you bad, okay? And this is what the arguments or the fuss or the chaos I feel like has been about here, okay? Yeah, why you do that to me, okay? Some of y'all may decide to remove yourself or again, as I mentioned, leave this particular person or you let this particular person know that I'm not going to settle for this. I'm not going to deal with being treated this way here. And so by you making that, uh, you know, necessary steps there, this person here is questioning now why you do that to me, why you leave me leos okay or vice versa this person's ex could be asking the same because they have decided to be with you leos okay i'm also picking that up as well so again i'm getting a lot of messages a lot of downloads just take what resonates for you and please leave here on the table what doesn't okay wow yeah we have the other man okay so there could be another man here involved if i'm speaking to a masculine energy here this could be a feminine energy here that you are with and there could be another man involved this could have been due to a third party situation here as i mentioned this person here may was still involved with this person from their past here and this other man is causing conflicts okay that your feminine energy here may decide to leave this relationship and this other man or other woman here is causing problems, okay? So, wow. Let's see what else. We have a yes here. So, yes may be very significant here regarding this situation. That may be confirmation. Some of y'all may have prayed about this situation here and your answer is yes, okay? Wow, look at that. I still care about you, okay? So this particular person here wants you to know, Leos, that they still care about you. Some of y'all, again, you may have called this person out on their shit with the Ace of Swords here, and you let this person go, and this person is now informing you that, look, Leos, I still have feelings for you. I still care for you. Wow, we have, I'm not ready to change, okay? So some of y'all, that's very significant. That could have been what this argument was about as well. You may have addressed this person about their habits or these patterns that they keep, you know, repeating and it comes with this relationship here and over and over again here. This could be the other man here that's not ready to change here. For some of y'all, if I'm speaking to a feminine energy here, or this could be the other woman that's not ready to change is why you decided to leave this particular person here. Wow. And then we have the mother. Okay. Some of y'all, this could have been the mother of your child. If I'm speaking to a divine masculine energy here or vice versa, you can flip it. This could have been the father. This could have been the mother or the father of your child here, Leo's, that was starting this drama here with you. And, you know, you just said this is enough. Enough is enough. Yeah, I am ready for this, okay? So some of y'all was like, look, I'm ready for someone that's going to appreciate me. I'm ready for someone that's going to understand me here. Others of you all, you are ready to be with this new person here. I'm also picking up some of you all have already moved on with someone new, and you're ready to be with this new person or this new energy here, okay? Wow. Oh, my goodness, loves. Let's get more. Let's dig in some more here. Yeah, we got meet me at the spot, okay? So, yeah, someone is definitely ready to haul ass in that cherry energy here. You may be getting ready to meet this person here, this person that you may held on to. I'm picking up for some of you all, someone that you decided, you know, in the back of your mind who you wanted to be here with. So there may be a particular spot that you two always meet up at here. And this person wants you to meet at the spot so you two can just leave off with each other here. Okay, yeah, we have I love your legs, Leos. Okay, wow. So some of you all, this person always loved your legs or something about your legs here is very significant here. 
Wow, Leos. I fucking love you, okay? So this particular person here wants you to know that I fucking love you. Yeah, I feel like someone has decided to leave a third party situation here and go after someone that they want to be here with or who they feel like makes them happy. And this particular ex or this person's ex here is not happy about the fact that your person is deciding to be with you. So you two are meeting at this spot that you two have always had so you can come up with a plan or a decision here on what you two want to do here. Okay, yeah, look at that. And this person wants you to know that I'm working for you. I'm working for this relationship. I'm working for this connection here. Oh, I can't stop thinking about you. So this particular person here wants you to know, Leo, that they cannot stop thinking about you. They cannot stop thinking about this relationship here. Wow, last card we have, they all knew about it. Yeah, definitely someone was involved in a third party situation or this just got out in the streets here. This information maybe got out is why you two was having to stay in a spot where no one else knew about here, okay? All right, wow, very significant reading here today, Leos. Definitely, again, if the reading here has resonated for you, don't forget to like, subscribe, my loves. Definitely make sure to adjust your notification bells for when I go live here on the platform and for your readings here on this platform. Again, if you would love to book a personal reading, Leos, I am available for personal readings. Also, loves, if you would love to extend your stay here and enjoy our Patreon or our Evolving Spirit Soul Tribe, that link is down below if you would love to see me on camera and live join our patreon so family where i do go live on camera for collective readings and live stream readings where i do also offer free questions each and every time i go live for the patreon and the soul family there you also get all the readings all the content that i post here on youtube you do receive that first as well my loves all right thank you all so much leos for your continuous love and support and remember your health is your wealth, Leos. Bye-bye.